You don't look the sort who can afford to turn down legitimate work. <coughs> what do you want? How about we start with a light? Elizabeth. You can call me Elizabeth. What can I do for you? There's a girl who needs to be found. Maybe you've seen her. This girl. This girl's dead. You know her. You'll see dozens of her type down by the docks or the slums in Apollo Square. Orphans. With Fontaine's charity shut. No place for them. But her you know. As I said, the girl's dead. Lost. Look, I don't know where you get- Lost isn't dead. Name your radar will pay you for this work. But you do this one gratis, wouldn't you? I don't follow. Something tells me you will. Seems my instincts were correct. Where's Sally? I don't know, but I know someone who does. Follow me. What's this girl to you? What I need from her is my business. But I know where to start looking. Something tells me a man with your particular talents could be useful. Great. Was los? Ain't you playing the ponies no more? You're too good for the boys at the track now. Einstein would have remained a patent clerk. It's our responsibility to strive. Here, here. the way to my heart is philosophical transcendence. He's brilliant. If I wanted brilliant, I'd go to bed with a book. You're just trapped by petite bourgeois notions of romance, aren't you? <laughs> Take it whatever way you will. But a girl wants what a girl wants. Uh, Ryan, <laughs> he's a big fish in an awful small pond, you ask me. Anything you say, pal. If I was running things, I'd say, why just one city? Why not two, eh? Why not three? Beauty 
fades, the mind is eternal. Tell that to my grandfather. The man thinks he's got feathers in a beak. Time before Ryan's ghouls round up anybody talks bad about him. I mean, just look what happened to Frank Fontaine. What happened to these children? Red what are they? Stop. Where have you been? Go. Cabin in Arcadia? Little sisters. Atom factories. It's grotesque. Keep moving, buddy. Compromise? Is that why we came to Rapture? I could compromise in Red Hook. We're just men and women, Alan. You hold yourself to that standard, you'll never be happy. In what country is there a place for men like me? Men who refuse to say yes to the doubters and the parasites. Yes, yes, but even Andrew Ryan takes a vacation. Come on, come on. We haven't got all day. vote on it. Otherwise, it's just a knee-jerk response from the uninformed. It does more harm than good. Who would judge that? A system like that invites abuse? Having a benevolent dictatorship takes care of that. Benevolence isn't human nature. is Ryan's been good to me few are the patrons who truly understand the struggle of the artist but even I was a little leery when he shuttered Fontaine's business and sent that bald buck to a grave deep in the briny. But when Ryan buried all of Fontaine's pals in that department store, someone had to find a home for all those freshly minted orphans. And if I turned a dollar or two in the process, you can hardly blame me for doing well by doing good. Parasites resent it, condemn it, or worse yet, take credit for themselves. Nice finally consorting with the equally talented, eh? <laughs> Getting recognized properly, being part of something bigger. The meat can go ahead and inherit the earth for all I care. I'm fine right here in Rapture.
works for Ryan's security firm. I got it firsthand. Cook's a fella from the inside out. Is a damn thing a weapon or an oven? Works with mini rays or, or microwaves? Oh, I can't remember. All I know is it sounds dreadful. Funny. What? You're not knowing about the little sisters. How long have you been in Rapture? Let's just say I don't get out much. You've got eyes and ears, don't you? If I wanted to share my life story, Mr. DeWitt, I would write my memoirs. If I learned anything about Rapture, I thought it was a place where people understood to mind their own business. Stick sees you, he'll toss you out on your ass again. Got some nerve showing your face around here, pal. Just say the word, I'll show you what I mean. Hello, old bean. Where are we headed? The man we need to see is in the Garden of the Muses. How do you know? My sources are my own, Mr. DeWitt. If you have better information as to the whereabouts of your girl, I suggest you avail yourself of it. Where are you taking me? When's the last time you saw Sally? What? She was taken from you, wasn't she? How do you know this? She was taken, down at Surprise. You were playing the tables and... She disappeared. And? A cop friend of mine, Sullivan, says they found her floating in the docks. You see the body? Look. Did you see the body? This world values children, not childhood. There's a profit to be made and men who make it. I'm taking you to one of them. <sighs> Mr. DeWitt, you all right? I'm fine. Just get these spells sometimes. It'll pass. Refreshment, sir. Madam? We're fine, thanks. Decent sort, but the antenna eyes. Papa this and Papa that. They can't take a crap without a papal dispensation. He gets that from his father. No one from my side of the family was ever so lackadaisical. up like this. Foreman says I should have been more careful. Mm, something will turn up. Adversity breeds opportunity, that's what Ryan says. Is there anything I can do? Hey, Mary, why so down in the mouth? I don't know, Jim. I guess I just don't know how I feel about those little sisters. The little sisters? Gee, don't you know they're the little adults? Rapture. Oh, 
all them orphanages and poorhouse did was to encourage the takers. Give a man a hand, he'll take an arm. taking over Fontaine's business, any different than, say, eminent domain. It's just the hand of government coming down on the individual. Fontaine was a criminal. By whose standards? Ryan's? I prefer when the judge is Mr. DeWitt, we'll find my source inside of that club. Cohen? What does that lunatic have to do with Sally? But he's a gentle giant. Do you know all he does for Rapture? These metal jets are the hands that maintain Rapture, digging the foundation out of the seabed and guiding structural supports into place. Where do these metal mysteries come from? Sorry, chum, that's a Ryan Industries trade secret. Now you know. Whatever that barber did to you, I hope he's retained a capable attorney. issue with my food pail. You're welcome to put on an apron. I had all of these visions before coming down here of Utopia. Every man with his hand on the great chain, the wheel of progress turning. Every cliche you can imagine. And what is the first thing that happens when I open up shop? Petty thievery. Now I have to lock all my valuables in the closet. Remember, 2076. It's the problem with coming to Utopia, is that it still has the people. Tip. I don't think these supermen know the meaning of the word. Bridget Tenenbaum?
When Ryan take over Fontaine Futuristics, scene of the terrible violence. Splices burning each other to bits. Lucky ones not killed, sent to department to stop prison instead. Suchon think he dead man too. But then, Ryan comes to Suchong and says, Su Chung want to be buried in filthy store, or Su Chung want to make a good salary? Work for Ryan. How much salary? asks Su Chung. This Ryan find very funny. Good day to you, sir. like gulag <laughs> temporary until someone puts bullet in your head this clown bomb understand something fundamental. Bonjour, signore. observe strangest of coincidences. On other side of a window, man in strange hat experimenting on Su Chung's own creation. On plasmid. Man name of Fink. Outrage! Death of intellectual property! <sighs> but man name of Fink is no fool. Through addition of oxidizing agent, turns plasmid ingestible through stomach lining. Mr. Ryan very impressed with Su Chong's initiative. Theft of intellectual property, two-way street. Fontaine got taken out by Ryan's goons. Are you in the know? You've doubtlessly sampled products from Fontaine Futuristics. But do you know why Ryan Industries saved it? Frank Fontaine, business leader and benefactor of mankind? Or was he the best friend the parasite ever had? Were you aware his businesses were a front for a smuggling ring? And were you also fooled by his supposed charity work? At his free clinic, patients became test subjects, and his orphanages were places that children disappeared into and never came out. Once they learned the truth, Rapture's Central Council called for the arrest of Fontaine Futuristic's owner. But, a coward to the end, Fontaine found a hail of bullets preferable to facing justice. The Council asked that Ryan Industries assume the burden of stewardship of Fontaine's ill-gotten assets. 
and Andrew Ryan accepted that burden for the people of Rapture. Now all citizens can enjoy these products, free of criminal taint. Now you know. Private party. No entry without invitation. We'll see about that. Which business do you represent, sir? Uh, business? Yes, which business? DeWitt Investigations. Mr. Cohen does not truck with private detectives. Masks of invitation went to artists and craftsmen alone. I'm with the artist struggle. We're expected... No mask, no entry. Stuff shirt. These invitation masks he spoke of. They must have gone out to local artisans. Well, I guess we'll have to persuade someone to loan us one. The business of Rapture is business. It says it's sponsored by the Artist Struggle, the Golden Rule, and Rapture Records. I guess those stores would be as good a place to start as any. you to rapture a man really you don't strike me as the romantic type wasn't that kind of man then what there's a debt that needs repaying I've known my share of Shylocks you're no Shylock the master of unlocking wasn't that kind of debt invitations to Cohen shows are highly coveted Nobody's gonna just hand us one. You think you can figure out a way to distract the store owner while I take a look around? You just find the mask. Leave the distractions to me. Good day to you, ma'am. Excuse me. The lady has some questions for you. Yes, of course. I'm interested in this piece. Ah, excellent. You've an eye, haven't you, miss? It's a natural sapphire and diamond, 18 karat gold ring, fully hallmark for Paris, 1887. sends those masks out in some kind of box.
find another shop. Take your time. Take it all in. in with, Smart for you give her the star treatment, pal, and I'll make it worth your while. But of course, right away. Interesting, isn't it? An original Sander Cohen. He calls it miasma. I'm sorry, but I know precious little about art. How does it make you feel? I don't want to open my mouth for it. fear of what foolishness might tumble out. Gotta find that box. Would you like me to tell you what... Oh, I would like so much to understand. In this piece, Cohen intended to show us the struggle of the great man, condemned to breathe the swampy air of the parasite. <laughs> you see all that in that little picture? Yes. Nothing. Uh, did you oh, you? only one place left. Oh, what's this one? Oh, please, it's so beautiful. What does it mean? My dear, that is something truly extraordinary. Shall I ex You have given me so much to think about. I, I feel a trifle swoony. W would you mind if, if I return tomorrow for further education? Nothing? No. We've got one place left, though. And if that proves to be fruitless? We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Have you ever met the man? I used to see him all the time. He needs to Can I help you? I'm not looking at you. Hey, pal. You want to help out the little lady? Yes, of course. What is this piece? It's by Trinet. But of course... Where is he hiding that box? the mask. Third time's the charm. All right. It's best we head back to Cohen's. Fine piece of work back with those shopkeeps. You've got a bit of the grifter in you. For that, you can thank my father. Oh, yeah? He was a man comfortable in a variety of roles. field you in? Field? Yeah, you know, occupation. Can't imagine what kind of employment would lead you to tag along on a job like this. I suppose you could say I work in debt collection. This better work, otherwise we'll certainly look the fools. Trust me. Ah, 
Very well. Mr. Cohen awaits your participation at his performance. So who is this fellow Cohen? Some sort of underworld figure? Worse. He's an artist. An artist who kidnaps children? Well, Cohen's muse is a bit more diverse. I've seen his type. Gets an idea in his head, end a conversation. Don't matter who gets hurt. <laughs> <laughs> 